Hello and welcome back to Divinity Resistance in 2 with me Barden. Right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go find Gareth and talk to him. Looks like he's up here. Okay, good. Let's chat with you. You come at last. I'd no doubt you'd find your way to us. Not after witnessing your bravery. I know you seek answers. I'll tell you what I can. I've been to the Hall of Echoes. Could I be one of these, Godwoken? You have spoken to a god? Gareth stares intently, not so much at you as through you. Is that a good or a bad thing? Yes. I see something there. But it's not for me to say. I must get you to Malady. She will know. Okay, cool. She was imprisoned on the Lady Vengeance. One of the few of us not left to rot on the sand and sun. All the more vital we take the ship from the Magisters. Godwoken. How did the Seekers end up finding shelter here? we just landed on shore. Minutes later, Dallas sailed in on the Lady Vengeance, screaming like a banshee. We had no hope. Most of us were dead in the blink of an eye. She had horrors at her side. Shriekers, they call them. They still protect the harbor, firing pure death at anything that catches their eyes. Oh, it doesn't sound the Lady good. Vengeance is still anchored there, too. Lucian, save us from whatever plot Dallas is concocting on it. What happens next? Do you have a plan? Well, I had a plan. Gratiana told me of weapons that could counter these shriekers. Purging ones that steal source from its host. Interesting. I went to that armory looking for one of these wands, but Alexander's bootlickers stumbled in first. I found nothing but dust and blood. We've got to find a way to silence those shriekers. If we do that, the Lady Vengeance is ours. Freedom is ours. I already have a weapon. A wand that can destroy shriekers. You do? But that's incredible. I can only imagine what ghoul-ridden depths you braved to find one. I had no doubt. You bring me hope, sorcerer. I'll gather the other seekers and travel to shore. Meet us there as soon as you can. Gareth's voice echoes throughout the enclave with such command it could rouse a fawn to action. We move, seekers. Now is the time to resist. The Lady Vengeance will be ours! Okay, so he's only just got here and we sent them off somewhere else again. Well, at least we got some experience from that. Let's have a chat with Han now. The others wouldn't let me join them for the fight. You should get moving, though. They'll need you at their side. Ty wouldn't block. That's interesting. I think we maybe screwed ourselves over a little, though. By doing this. Oh, we can't. Oh, well, we can do this, though. Teleport. Barrel. To here. Got to be something in it. Oh. <laughs> well, if there was. It's not in it there anymore. Uh, sorry. Whoever owned that. Very, very sorry. Right. So, the, this stuff we can take. Always interested in stuff that we're allowed to take. Book, sheet of paper, sheet of paper. I guess because the squire has gone off now, we just need that anymore. I guess. Let's check in there. Okay, nothing. And more fish. Okay. Now, I think what we're going to do is well, we're going to loot first. Okay, everybody's gone. It wasn't a good idea, I think, to tell. Is Gratiana gone as well, then? Where is Gratiana? There's a pool. No, I think she's there. Or is she? Oh, maybe she isn't. No, I don't think she's here anymore. Okay, that's interesting. Yeah, we sent them all off. Okay, uh, oops. But we can check all this stuff, I guess. Because I guess the game thinks that we're going to be going to a new area, so there's no need. Well, take all this stuff. 
right now. So we're not going to be hanging around here either. But we're not going to go to that fight. We, we're going to explore a bit more. So... Let me think. Oh yeah, I know where I want to go. There's something that I saw in one of Game Night's videos and I want to try it myself. So we need to find the way that we came in, which was here. Okay, so let's go there and then let's pop over here. Yeah, and then we can teleport across here and check all this stuff out. So that's going to be fun. And luckily we have two people who can teleport now, so it won't take as long. And he can, he has a skill as well that allows him to teleport. Yeah. Teleportation. So what's your skill? Shocking arrow, no, that's not it. Haste, no. Wait, did someone just come and then go somewhere else? Yeah, I think they did. Over here. Right. Now, you have... Can he... Come here. Stop going backwards. Right, stay there. Good. Now, you teleport... Red Prince over there. Okay. Then... You teleport her there. You then, where's the one that's... Tactical retreat, that's it. Oh, we can't go over there. We'll go there and then try it. There you go. Go to there. Okay. Then you can teleport yourself. Yeah. No, okay. So you can teleport. Oh, no, this teleport scroll, don't use that. Teleport her. There. Teleport. Oh, we can't see her. Okay. Move there. Teleport. Ah! Seriously? closer. There, that should work. Teleport you and put you there. Okay. Yeah, so we can get around that. Right, Ifan. You're the guy we have to use for searching stuff. Let's remember that. Go search there. Oh, look at this. Okay. A nice ring. A restoration scroll. A long tail a long rat tail, sorry. Okay, so who can use the ring? Probably one of these two. Yeah. Let's go down to Ifran. Okay, Arrow Thurge. You're the Arrow Thurge, aren't you? Yes, you are. Okay, equip that. Get up to level six. Beautiful. Now, on we go. Okay, so there's some shells here, we'll take the shell. Even though they'll say that's just crap, but hey ho. We find then go search that. Okay, some gold, nice. Yeah, anything else we can search. Certainly not from this angle. Okay, well let's keep going on then go through here and turn the camera Ooh, what was that she set off a trap some kind of trap oh and we can go up this way okay let's go up there okay and then we can go up again which is good let's go up there Here. So we can go that way. And also go around there. Okay. 
Well, let's go in here first. This isn't a bad idea. And then Ifan will get to search. Okay, we got ourselves a book. And oh, tie wooden block. Okay. And then nothing. Still pretty nice. Now turn the camera again. Now want to go where? Do we search? Yeah, we search that. Okay. Right there and there. You want to go over here onto this. Yeah. Okay, guys, make your way down there. So we're basically skirting around this whole maze place here. But what this will do is this will get us to another fight. Now this guy is a bit of a dick, but we'll talk to him anyway. Red Prince, you're probably the biggest dick in our party, so you talk to him. Stern eyes and a sterner face stare into your very soul. Under the inescapable gaze, you begin to shiver uncontrollably. Another crawling rat, tracking your stinking paws beneath my nose. Vermin are not tolerated in my house. Be gone! Oh, nice. Uh, let's bow before the statue and apologize profusely. Do not doubt my power. I merely wish you gone. You are gone. Big. Oh. That git. Where did he put us? He put us back at the start, I think. Oh, <laughs> git. Okay. So we've got to make our way on, yeah. Let's put us all the way back at the start. So we have to go and make our way back around, I guess. Okay. Hmm. Well, don't talk to that asshole again, then. Is what we've learned there. So we have to go here. And we have to do the whole teleport thing again. At least we know everybody needs to get right into the water this time. You're one asshole, eh? <laughs> this, this game is full of them. And it wouldn't be as good if it wasn't, I don't think. If everybody was nighty nice, it wouldn't be as good. Right, so let's start getting people across. Go into the water. Yeah, now. You teleport. Him. Just there. Okay. And you. Oh. Is that the right one? Yes, it is. Her. Just there. And you two. Move up. Move up. There you go. You tactical retreat over there, and you teleport her over there. Now let's just get back up here and ignore that asshole this time. Okay, turn the camera up there. Here and ignore Mr. Asshole. Oh, interesting. This some kind of angel statue in there. Okay, and where we actually want to go is up these steps. Yeah, we want to go there. Anything to loot around there first? Maybe there is, maybe there isn't. Or oh, there's a source point there. That's where the burning guy is on the thing. Well, we'll, we'll deal with him later, but for now. We 
want to go up here. And then we can grab that source point. The stony gaze of the gargoyle holds you fast. Gravel rumbles in its throat. Nice. Stranger, you enter topsy-turvy. Let's show him the ring of the Source King. Welcome home, Master. Nice. Sabeel has taken Band of Brachus from the Red Prince using magic pockets. Okay. okay. Nice. So he thinks we're the Master. Okay. And then we're going to go inside. When we go inside, I think that's when the fight starts. Be sure. Or it's going to be pretty soon after. Yeah, there's people over here. Your lizard empire still stands. So we're going to try and go. Oh, we can't go there because they have the key, I believe. But maybe he can open it real lock. No, she be leveled too low. Okay, well, let's check this and this. Okay, now we're gonna get in a fight here, but these these guys resurrect, so we kind of have to kill them and then get through that door with the key that we get off them. So we might have to kill them twice or even more than that. Here, did I ever tell you of the time I cursed that court eunuch? Eunuch to speak only truth in the admission of these Bracus's mistress. Can't get up there. Yes, you did. Right, well. How about the time Let's just get in and get the fight started. The dance macabre, yes, I recall. As you enter the room, you see three skeletons sitting around a table, cards in hand. They creak and turn to stare at you. A beating heart. Does Bracus need us once more, Jailer? Are we finally to be freed? I'm the jailer, here to check on your prisoners. That door has been sealed for centuries, but now you're here to check on us? Yes. Let it speak. Tell us, what news? Does Bracus still sit on the throne? What ruin has he brought to the land? What care I of Bracus? Tell us, invasive flesh. Does the harlot Gratiana share his bed still? Does she still serve his wicked desires? Nothing has changed. Bracus still rules with Gratiana at his side. So, even after all this time, the traitor enjoys her reward for turning us over. We sit here, our best bits rot into nothing, while she sups on sauce with Bracus and jousts with him in bed. There is no justice in the world. <laughs> Sorry news indeed. The harlot may have foiled our plot against Bracus, but today is not without its gift. What gifts has the day brought you? I bet you it's us. Why, a body of flesh and source that has opened the door to the world beyond. Sorry, sweet pea, but it's a fair point. We may need your source, but the good news is you'll make a beautiful corpse. If you think breakfast is bad, you should see our curses. Okay. There's no curse in this world that I fear more than this. And no foe that I fear less than death. Okay, well, we're gonna kick the crap out of you. This is gonna be a fun battle. Now, Ifan, can you. Yeah, you can attack the retreat up there. So do that. Good. Because then that's gonna give him the height advantage. Then he can. Seriously? Did they put that there on purpose? I bet you they did. Right, well, move over here. Yeah, do that. Oh, nice. Okay, next. You go here. Yeah. And so, no physical armor on either of those. So I think you're maybe the one what we do to you. Let's encourage first. Okay, good. Then 
Uncanny evasion. Um, you? Okay, good. Okay, you didn't do much. Now. Don't. Okay, I was gonna do stuff that would probably end up healing them because they're undead. Okay, so don't do that. Use this. Okay, because we may as well start working on their non, their magical defenses. And then, let's see, let's go here. So the Red Prince is going to be able to knock one of them down only. So let's get an incarnate. It there. Okay. Then it's gonna provoke her and then attack her. Okay, so her physical is almost gone, and it's turn. Now bed prints. Oh here. Okay. This will not go to them now. Okay, great. And incarnate. Flash her again, so her physical is gone. And now she can stay into her. Okay, in turn. She's up there. And then she's got soul band as well. Okay. Right, so we need to kill her to get rid of that, I guess. Ooh, wow. Okay, now. Let's start killing you. Good, and again. Excellent. And end your turn. He just stands up. Low say. Let's see. Let's teleport. That thing. Okay. Oh, missed. Oh no, we got it. Okay, let me see. Missed what we did. Okay, then I'll see. You may as well restore yourself. Okay, and then end your turn. Now, Seville. Let's see, you got those. That has no. Magic armor. So, I'll yield to none. I'll do that. In Basher. That hurts, doesn't okay. it? Now, Red Prince. Let's see. That right there. Need to get three of them. If you go there. And then use this. Say, go 
Where is the body? There, okay. Go we'll search that. Okay. No key on her. So one of these two must have the key. Right, well... You go attack that guy. Good. And provoke him. Okay, nice. Okay. Ooh, we're out if I'm. Right, yeah, Sabeel. Team, though. Now, incarnate. Oh, well, you should have used your range attack. So, one of these two has the key that we're looking for. Okay, and hopefully, it's him. Now, we found. Shoot. Okay, and again. Okay, now. Get looting. Key. There's the key. So we're we're on the clock here because they resurrect. Go go go. Open the door. What are you doing? Okay. Here we go. Now, aren't there? Yeah. There you go, they resurrect. Strike. Apparently their soul jars are in here somewhere. I can't remember exactly where. Now, let's start taking people individually around, because I don't want the entire group getting themselves in trouble. So from there. Okay. Go fish, you know. Let's try down here. Did I ever tell you of the time I cursed that court union? Place and scroll the size. Let's grab that. So the laboratory stuff. Oh, books. Actually, you should be coming in here. Because you're the guy who will give us extra stuff. Let me check. So check there, please. There we go. Book. More laboratory stuff. Junk. <laughs> nice. Just call it junk, don't you? Me. 
think there's going to be a f some kind of trap. I think. Is this the room where the trap is? Probably is. So far, nothing though. Sharp rock. Okay. I'll take that. Let's search that. And turn camera. So it always seems to be something else. But there's something in there. Look, there's a zombie in there. Okay. Almost a zombie. Okay, it's locked. So we can't let the zombie out. He'd probably just attack us if he did anyway. And don't go into the Iron Maiden, that would just be stupid. Go to search there now. Okay, another book. I'm there. Okay. On the doll, red fence. We'll make your way out as well. Now. Where to next? Where is there? I think that's where we want to go. What's the story with this statue, Shrine to the Seven? Among the long crumbled remains of the temple that must have once sheltered his shrine, the stone effigy of a god seems to invite you to put your hands in his. So he can't do anything. Among the long crumbled remains... Among the long crumbled yeah, remains of... Part. Okay. But well, he goes search these. Nothing. Okay, search those. Okay. Now, head on over there. Careful now. It's a trap. Oh, there you go. Yeah, it is a trap. <laughs> you should have heeded your own advice. Now, yeah, let's reconnect. Wow, he sprinted there, that was crazy. Right, now, we have some source, so I think she can open this. The air around the glowing relic thrums with power as the source barrier quietly crackles in the background. Let's call up our source powers and focus them on the relic. The hum of the relic grows louder and bright light starts to spill from its runes. Cracks start to spread across the surface, and it shatters like glass. Okay, great. That actually worked. Now, Ifan, find that rat and have a chat with him. Or her. You don't look lost at all. Are you being sarcastic? Sarcastic me? Not at all. I'd never be sarcastic me. Oh, no. Not in the least. <laughs> you still sound sarcastic. I do not. I sound perfectly normal. Obviously. <laughs> The rat gives you a desperate look. Help me. Are you able to tell the truth without sarcasm? Or are the rat you? opens its mouth to speak. Can't say anything. So it nods its head, then shakes its head, then nods it again. Okay, so are you somehow constrained by nature or magic never to tell the truth? The rat tries to nod its head. And fails. It tries to shake its head and fails. Its head ends up doing a strange, jerking diagonal movement that could mean anything. For a rat. This is. This is. This is not frustrating. And you are not a clever creature, not having rumbled my quandary. Get me? Is your problem physical or magical? Physical. It makes a face that says, understand. What might cure your The fiction? rat gives you a grave and meaningful look, inviting you to listen carefully. I don't think the problem is in my head, and further to that, I don't think the problem could be unscrambled by the use of source. I can categorically state that a short, sharp shock with something of a magical persuasion would absolutely not solve my problem immediately. And I do not invite you to look at the subtext in what I just said.
What did you see magic on you kill you? The rat gives you a long stare that tries and fails to say, of course not. Okay, I'll see what I can do. The rat breathes a long sigh of relief, closes its eyes, and steals itself for what's coming. Okay, so I think we need to shock the rat. Hope this works. I want to kill the poor guy. Uh, uh oh. We did kill him. Okay, uh, sorry about that, rat guy. I guess we should have done it differently. Well, we know now. Well, you can't save everyone, as they say. Oh, check you. Check the news. That one doesn't matter now, but still, it should have been you in the first place. Right, and then in here. A door, we don't want to use that door. We want to go in. Oh, we want to search these now. There's going to be something amazing on this skeleton. She told you nothing. Right, head in here. Oh, some nice experience. Good. So, what exactly is in here? Some statues, a skeleton. Can't reach, so teleport the skeleton, maybe. I can't see it. Can you see it from there? No. Right there. Okay, I guess we can't. Can't get it now. We probably would be able to with a bit of work, but. I don't be looking about too much. Okay, so and here we come. Okay, some decent gloves. Oh geez, she's going crazy. And a nice ring as well. Check there. Some good boots as well. Check there. Nothing. Here. Nothing. Eight barrels, more barrels, skull pile, oh, okay, magic dwarf and staff, 22 to 27 water, wow, we're definitely going to be using that, I'm going to do all of these before I check these. I'm not even sure if we're strong enough to get to open those anyway. Okay, there's some cash. Nothing. Okay, try this. Won't budge. You try. Too heavy. Who's the strongest then? Strength 13, strength 11, strength 10, strength 13. Okay. So we need more than 13 strength, I guess. Right, well, we'll have to come back and check those at a later date. Mm, we're pretty much out of time. Yeah, I think we're out of time, so. What I'll do is what's in there. I don't know. Okay. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this particular video. Then we search a bit more in the next video and hopefully find ourselves another fight as well. But for now that's it for me. So if you've enjoyed the video, please consider hitting the like button, sharing with your friends or on your favorite social media, and I really do hope to see all of you next time. Goodbye. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, maybe you'll hit the subscribe button there on the right and check out some other videos here on the left.